Hi, this will be a brief overview of the Helium Digital Extension Board. We'll walk with you how to connect a simple sensor and the features of the Digital Extension Board. But first, let's take a look at the board itself. Take it out of the case to reveal the Extension Board ribbon cable, followed closely behind by the Extension Board itself. We've also got the Helium Atom Dev Board here, but let's talk about what the extension board has on it before we connect it. The first thing to note is two addressing jumpers. We also have a 10 pin sensor bus. And then we have 20 pins, 16 of which are digital IO, two are ground, and two are power. So, to connect the extension board to the dev board, we'll need this extension board ribbon cable. Make sure to match up the tab on the ribbon cable with the tab printed next to the 10 pin header on the extension board. Click it in and do the same thing for the Atom dev board. So let's wire up a sensor to the digital board. Here we have a digital read switch with some jumpers soldered on. And we're gonna connect this to two pins. One will go to ground, and one will go to any of the 16 digital pins. And that's it. So when you apply power to the dev board and flick the switch on, you've got yourself a digital read switch powered by the digital extension board. Have fun.